Garrett Cole takes the loss in this one, allowing five runs over five innings. He was caught by Kyle Higashioka. Let's hear from him. Kyle, what were you seeing from Cole today? Um, you know, I I thought I thought he wasn't you know as bad as as the line looks. You know, um, thought he made a lot of quality pitches. Uh, you know, just we just happened to get. You know, they just happened to get that that big hit in in you know the right situations. There was some soft contact, some tough calls. Could you sense frustration from him this afternoon? A little bit. I think I think we were all a little frustrated. And then you slowed down a, a little bit offensively from the beginning of the season. Just how are you feeling at the plate? What do you think's going on? Uh, making some adjustments right now. Um, you know, it's it's feeling feeling better than I did a, a week or two ago, but you know, just still not hitting the ball hard enough, um, often enough. What what adjustments do you make so that happens? Um, there was just some directional issues with my um, stride, and and you know, it's causing me to to really close myself off. But um, you know, without getting into details, I'm just just trying to make sure that I have, you know, keep that margin for error in my swing. Um, you know, I've had to had to be a little too perfect with the timing. So, you know, when I get one, it's good. But, um, you know, I'm not hitting the ball hard often enough. Tom Merriam, go ahead. Kyle, given the standings and the fact that you only have six more games against Tampa Bay the rest of the way, did you need more than a split in the series? Um, I mean, I guess we'll just see after the season's over. Anyone else? Jordan Horvin, go ahead. Kyle, uh, Garrett had talked about his his fastball being able to locate it at the top of the zone being really important for him. How how key is that in terms of sort of unlocking the effectiveness of the rest of his of his offerings? It, it definitely helps, um, you know, the fastball at the top of the zone. It's just, you know, because he throws so hard and has, uh, you know, so much late life on his ball, it um, it's really a good equalizer for um, the Osby pitches, and you know, it's definitely one of one of his his main weapons. Joel Sherman, please unmute. Kyle, uh, your manager continues to say uh, that your the team's best baseball is ahead of it, uh, and he's been pretty consistent about that. A not insignificant amount of time has passed in the season, more than a third of the season. Why, why should it be believed? I assume you believe it also. Why should it be believed that there's a lot better than has been performed so far this year? Well, I think, you know, some guys, and myself included, um, you know, are, have, have kind of, Underperformed a little bit um, so far, but I mean, at this point in the season, you know, we still got two thirds of the way left. I, you know, I have all the faith in the world that that we're gonna we're gonna get hot, and you know, hopefully we get hot at the right time, which is, you know, heading into, you know, a playoff run. Hopefully, so, um, you know, that that's, you know, we just we just have to keep the faith and and keep grinding and and make sure that we're just 